All right, uh, progress on the frame. I have the uh, shock mounts um, put up. I took this uh, rectangular tubing, the same thing I used on the motor mounts. It's not tubing, it's pipe. It's a uh, real heavy wall thick stuff. And uh, cut a V in it, just cut a V in it and bent this down and then set it so it's level. And um, welded on the two tabs to hold the uh, shock tower right there and then ran it up to right here and then I took two pieces of pipe uh, this is one inch uh, pipe and bent them just shoved them way back in there and welded them up inside and they come down and go into the frame like so and uh, you'll notice there's a cross piece right in line with this uh, that's pretty strong there and that one goes right up into that too Now I will have to uh, do some bottom welding once we get the uh, engine off and further down the road we'll turn the whole fr frame over and uh, weld all the underside stuff and we got one more thing to do the uh, uh, dog bone was connected right there which stopped the, the engine from flopping back and forth except that <clears throat> we're going to do a solid mount since Everything else is solid mount. The whole motor is solid mounted in. So we're going to make a, a custom built solid mount that runs from here down to the frame somewhere right in there. And uh, that's just to hold it steady. And so there'll be four, uh, four mounts, four engine mounts for this setup. So that's, uh, that's it for tonight. Sunday night and uh, uh, time to go get cleaned up. And, crash. Yeah. I think it looks pretty good. Hope it works.